Hey y'all, Mary Kennedy here from Kennedy Fan 5 and Algebra Student. If you are a teacher um, and you or your school has a document camera, um, those are awesome for teaching constructions to a, a big group at once. If you have the document camera, then you can do the constructions underneath the camera and they're literally, you know, whatever they're watching, whether they're watching on the screen in the front of the room, classroom, or the screen on their computer, they're seeing you actually doing the construction. They're not, they're not seeing like a, a generated image. They're seeing, um, you know what I'm saying? Like they're actually watching video of you doing the construction. So I found that to be invaluable in classroom, like the document camera. And so our library, I'm really old. Our media center had document cameras that we could check out for the year. And um, so that's what I did. And, you know, a couple other of the math teachers on our, in our department, we, we use them a tremendous amount, especially for things that are super visual where kids needed to see exactly what you were doing as you did the process. Um, and actually need to see your, your actual work and writing and stuff like that. So that's a good thing. Okay. So if you are a teacher or you're a homeschooling parent or you're a student watching this, um, this is the website that to me was the most useful for students to see kind of what was going on um, after I demonstrated it myself, then they could watch it on a loop. And um, while I went around and helped everybody individually that was, you know, having questions. And so it is math open ref like reference.com and then slash constructions, I think, but or slash TOC slash constructions. Anyway, you just go to mathopenref.com. There's a whole list of table of contents. Um, there's probably tons of other really, really good resources there, but this is where I used it and it's super helpful. So um, it might even help you if you're not sure how to complete the construction as the teacher or the parent, then um, you can watch you know, demonstrations there and the demonstrations are computer generated. So it's not, you're not watching a person do it, but you're seeing the animation of the process with like a, um, you know, computer generated compass and that kind of thing. But it's, it's good. It's really good stuff. They also have detailed step-by-step -step written instructions. And um, so it's a great resource. I think that's it. I hope this helps. Let me know in the comments. I would love to hear from you. Just, you know, like, what did I leave out? What did you have questions about? All right. Thanks. Bye.